Hello my fellow oddities, welcome to a new video. Today we are playing Mortal Kombat X, continuing the road to Mortal Kombat 1. Uh, like last time with Mortal Kombat 9, which you should go check out that series if you haven't already. Uh, I will have subtitles, so I will be talking over the cutscenes and stuff, but since you have subtitles, you guys should be able to read just fine, as long as you're above the age of 5. So, yeah, but um... Now we're just continuing the road to Mortal Kombat 1. Next time we'll play Mortal Kombat 11, but right now we're playing Mortal Kombat X, which has a eh, very safe, not the best story mode, but you know what, it's not like atrociously bad or anything, so it's it's harmless, I guess. It's harmless, but it's not like, like super crazy, good, amazing or anything. Where he sent his toughest fighters. But uh, yeah, I just got this today on Steam. I do have Mortal Kombat X, of course. I've played this game before. Uh, I have it on my Xbox, but uh, it's a pain to, to set up console recording and have it upload on YouTube and uh, all that stuff. It, it's just it's just simpler, all right, to, to just get it on my PC. It was on sale for like $5. I got it literally at the last minute. There was like five hours left in the sale. I got it for $5, so that was cool awesome got it today and so yeah i'm not gonna have like any stats or anything uh, i did do a little bit of practice just a tiny tiny bit but that's that's about it we're going into the story pretty much with almost no experience i mean i've played the game before of course and it's not my favorite mortal Kombat game in terms of gameplay i know people really really like it but it's not my favorite but yeah, I've done some practice. I'm probably not going to be that good, but uh, we'll see. All part of Shinnok's plan to escape the Nether Realm and resume his war on the. Elder I've been talking over this entire speech. Sorry, Johnny Cage. <laughs> I haven't been letting your your whole crazy speech, reiterating what happened in the last game, go through. But yeah, the Mortal Kombat X hype days were, were something else. Like this this opening scene, like th this opening scene was literally like a clip that was revealed. To the public before the game's release and like I remember all this it was crazy I remember being so excited so excited for this game because I was too young to really remember Mortal Kombat 9 type days and then Mortal Kombat 11 and that was more recent and I do remember Mortal Kombat 11 type days but uh, I just I don't know I don't, I don't remember it as fondly I guess as Mortal Kombat X like it was kind of my first like time period remembering a Mortal Kombat game being released soon. But Mortal Kombat 1 has a decent uh, hype as well, I guess. Like, we just got the uh, the Banished trailer with Ashra, uh, Havoc, and Reptile, and Serena. And that was really, really cool. If I had to rank them, I'd say Mortal Kombat X number one. Even though this game didn't end up being my favorite, or even like one of my favorite Mortal Kombat games. In fact, it's kind of one of my least favorites, but still, like Mortal Kombat X Hype Days, number one. Number two, Mortal Kombat 1. Right. Wait. You have the yeah, Mortal Kombat X, Mo number one. From there we I'm getting confused because I'm saying number one and then I'm saying Mortal Kombat 1, but number one is Mortal Kombat X. Number two, Mortal Kombat 1. Number three. Uh, Mortal Kombat 11. And that's not to say Mortal Kombat 11 type days were bad, it's just like, the other two were more exciting. I remember my uh, parents said, we're gonna pre-order Mortal Kombat X, alright? And I was like, oh, pre-ordering means that uh, you get the game early, right? Alright, I'm excited. And then, when they pre-ordered it, and I didn't get the chance to play the game, uh, and I couldn't play it, I was like, what the heck? We had pre-ordered it, right? And then they were like, no, that's that's not how it works. Pre-ordering. Pre-ordering means you just, like, buy it. And then when it comes out, you'll get it. Automatically. And then I was like, oh. And then I cried. But, you know, to be fair to me, I was like, eight or nine at the time. Alright. Ooh, we got Scorpion. And I'm probably gonna have to censor this whole scene. Because it's very, very violent. Oh shoot, I completely forgot the quick time events in this game. They never did this again. Oh my god. Kaboom. Kaboom. Apparently, Mortal Kombat X doesn't know the difference between 
PlayStation and Xbox because I'm using a PlayStation controller right now. Oh shoot. But it says, oh my god. Uh, but it says like A, X, Y, B, all that stuff. That's weird. Uh, get kicked. Yeah, get him, Kenshi. That just so happens to be your future son's mentor. Isn't that crazy how life turns out? Hello, Sub-Zero. So you guys have just been standing here, or sitting there, this whole time? You guys didn't even get up to help? Like, your fellow dead brethren? Nasty. Come on, Johnny, this is Mortal Kombat. You've seen way worse than that. Oh my god, Jesus Christ. Good about these dang quick time events. Sub-Zero just standing there waiting for me to hit him. Awesome. And that's why Bihan is the best Sub-Zero, and not Kwai Liang. Just saying. Kwai Liang's an idiot. Oh my god, Jesus Christ. Ugh. Get punched in the face. Reference to Mortal Kombat 1995. Uh, get elbowed, nut punch, and your head's bashed together. Kaboom. Bye bye. Awesome. Yeah. Ooh. Punch. Get out of here. Get out of here. All right. Now you can just like kick him out, Johnny. Like he's crawling back. You can just kick or you can tackle him kind of idiotic, but, uh, whatever. Okie dokie. Well then. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, we got our first fight. Johnny Cage versus Scorpion. The classic matchup from Mortal Kombat 1995. Ugh. Okay. Ow. Okay, don't hit me. Don't take me down like that either. I don't appreciate it. Ugh. Okay, you got to teleport. That's nice. Okay, I missed. Yep. All right. Now we're gonna do be doing a lot of that because I am not very good at MKX. I never have been. I've been better at Mortal Kombat 11, and Mortal Kombat 9. I'm decent at, but Mortal Kombat X. Yeah, it's not my strong suit. And that's why it's my least favorite in terms of gameplay. Yeah, it's literally one of those cases where I'm not good at it, so I don't like it. And I'm not afraid to admit that. <laughs> oh my god, Jesus Christ. Forgot about the fact that there's no rounds. Like, round two. It's just right back into it. And it doesn't help the fact that literally the first thing Scorpion did was like run at me. <laughs> oh my god, Jesus, calm down. It's sweeped. Have a Snickers. Okay. Ow. Alright. Uh, kick! Kick again! Kick again! What are you gonna do, Scorpion? Just gonna continue getting kicked? Alright, that works. Gotta get back to the chopper. Get to the chopper! That was an awful impression, jeez. Sonya, get Come on, I, I know I can do better than that. It's like, get to the chopper! That one's better, but it's still not great. <laughs> okay, Johnny doesn't seem too frozen by the ice ball that should usually freeze him, but whatever. That was unpleasantly cold. Yes, it was. All right. Okay. I think. Sub-Zero used to be one of my mains in this game. It was him and uh, Sector or Triborg, but the Sector variation because I don't know. It's just the best one. Okay. Ugh. Bam, 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 bam. Ooh, that was nice. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Bam. Okay. Really did the same thing twice and I fell for it the second time. That's crazy. Alright, get kicked. Okay, we're gonna do the age old strat. Okay, it just didn't work. Uh, age old strategy of. Uh, ugh. Okay, he doesn't fall for it like Scorpion did. He's not an idiot. Alright, come on. Like I said last time, 
I'm gonna refrain from doing any x-rays just because I don't want to get demonetized. Oh my god. Just calm down. Alright. Get hit with that thing. Nice. Finished him off. Alright, let's get back to the chopper. I liked it better when we fought on the same side. Yeah, when you were a cyborg. <coughs> you okay? We fared better than the men. Add them to the list of things Shin will answer for. Okay. Ooh, now we're at Raiden Sky Temple. I wish we got more of this in this game. More of, like, Shinnok's Netherrealm invasion. Because, like, as soon as, like, this game starts, it's like this first chapter, and then it goes 25 years in the future, and it's just like, man, we could have had a, such a cool game with, like, all the characters that we know and love, like, right after the event of Mortal Kombat 9, but no. We got the game we got, which is Combat Kids, the game. Also, Fujin should have been in this game. Base roster. Hopefully he's in Mortal Kombat 1 in some capacity. And we got Raiden, Fujin using their staffs. I remember, I think it was this scene. Like, one of these demons, like, stands over Raiden. And, like, someone thought it was, like, Onaga. Like, I remember in the hype days, in the hype days, like, someone saw a screenshot of, like, this right here, basically. This right here. Someone saw a screenshot of this, like, monster standing right over Raiden. And they thought it was Onaga. That was just, like, the speculation that was happening during the Mortal Kombat X hype days. It was the best. And then there was that one post by Ed Boon showing all the people's, like, feet. And that sounds crazy, but, like... It was a legit thing, and like you had to guess <laughs> whose feet, um, wh whose feet belong to which characters. The, the mighty gods, gods of Earth Realm. You be foul of these hallowed grounds, Quan Chi. Be, be gone. Surely you are pleased to see your friends. <gasps> Striker, Sindel, Cabal. Wait, S Sindel's not my friend. She is literally the one who you killed all these people. In fact, Cabal, Striker, y'all should be turning on her. Y'all should be like, hold up, you killed me. I'll kill you now. Also, wasn't Sindel already, like, dead? So, she died again. And then got resurrected again. As a different type of resurrected creature thing. I don't know, it's weird. It's just Mortal Kombat. It's just how it is. Alright, we're here. Sneaking up on them. Jax, smoke. Expect too soon. All right, let's move in on them. <gasps> Who's that? Nightwolf. I like how he has like, or like how his uh, axes and stuff that's usually glowing green. Like it's red now. Like that's the little things that I wish they did with more of the revenants that weren't playable. Like, I wish Smoke, like, had some sort of design aspect that wasn't just, like, his costume from MK9, but he has the Revenant skin. Like, I wish he had, like, something unique about him. Same thing with Cabal, same thing with Striker. I don't know, something like that. Just to signify that they're more evil. Jesus. Well, you went, smoke is dead, I'm an Enra. We cut to a scene, came right back, <laughs> and you're getting beat up. And now you're knocked out. All right, Smoke, you're not that guy. You're not that guy, pal. You're not that guy. Real Jax wouldn't punch his best friend. Believe me, any guy would punch their best friend. How do you run again? That's not how you do it. Like this? Okay, Jax, stop it. I don't know how you run in this game. Okay, I can dash. Okay, geez, calm down, all right? Oh, is it RB? Okay, calm down, Dax. 
Okay. I should focus on fighting. Okay. I'm not running. Okay. Okay. Nice try. Yeah. Sorry. I just I just needed to get that round. All right. I wasn't gonna let you steal that one. Don't say I never did anything for you. I still have no idea how to run. Okay. Uh. What button would it even be? Not the block button. That's stupid. Maybe it's this. Is it L3? Okay. Jax, calm down. Gee, okay, I said calm down. Oh my God, stop it! Stop! Stop, Jax. Jax, I will. I will start spamming you again. I will start spamming you. Oh, that was the wrong one. Okay. You want to do this? You want to play this game? All right, cool. We can play this game. I got more. No! Ugh, kick him! Dang, Johnny! Come on! All you had to do is kick him once. All you had to do is kick him once. Okay, what was that? All right, come on. All right, now we got him in the corner. I still don't know how to run. Oh, oh wrong thing. Ugh, get hit with that. That. Ugh. Oh, stop, Jax. Jax. Jax, can you teach me how to run? You've been doing it, like, a lot. Can I? <laughs> I'm gonna I'm straight up look. Because there... No, not not really. <laughs> There's no button to, to tell me how to run. Uh... Okay. Welp. I guess we're just not gonna run. We're just gonna play it like it's Mortal Kombat 11. Or Mortal Kombat 9. But I guess it's fine. It's been working for us. We're gonna fix you someday. Yes, you will. Spoiler alert. Although, you fix him, but he kind of goes into like well, PTSD recluse mode. So, I don't know. Maybe it was maybe it's just better to kill him. <laughs> That's not him. And yeah, and then he turns evil and helps like the the timeline be reset, and it's just like, oh man. But yeah, he, he low key, Jax. You guys keeping him alive and being like, we're gonna fix you. Yeah, it kind of resulted in the end of uh, in the end of the timeline. The timeline being destroyed by Kronika. But you guys don't know who that is right now, so I guess it doesn't matter. Could they hurry the hell up? All right. We don't gotta rush him. All right. I really like this design for Kenshi. I think it's like his best design. That he's ever had. Spoiler alert for my inevitable Kenshi all designs ranked. Let me just say, this is like the best design he's had. Going up. Fall back now. I think it's pretty much just his Deadly Alliance one, but I don't know. I like how it looks in this Go game. On. I like his Mortal Kombat uh, one look here. too, but that's pretty much just his Mortal Kombat X look, but like younger. For some reason, I always thought uh, when those two soldiers were like passing the C4 to each other, I always thought it was like a block of butter. Like, I don't know, that's just something weird that I always thought. Like, I thought it was supposed to be like a joke. Like, oh, they have butter on them. Like, I don't even really get what the joke would be, but like, I don't know. It does look like butter, all right? You can't blame me. Like, the C4 does look like butter. And, uh, yeah, I wouldn't get those two things mistaken if I were, uh, if, if, if I was. The one that happened to have C4 that looked like butter. I wonder what these black clouds are. I wonder if something's gonna happen. Oh wow, something did happen. Skeleton hands, spooky scary skeletons. Who's it? Who is it? Who is it? Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? You see it now, Raiden. Old man voice? Oh! <gasps> It's the lamest Mortal Kombat villain there is, Shinnok. You poison their hearts with hope. And what do you offer? The same as you did millennia ago, when you betrayed your fellow Elder Gods and attacked Earthrealm. We stopped you then, imprisoned you in the Netherrealm. We will do so again. Remove the shadow from the light. The shadow grows. Shadow? Noob Saibot? Noob Saibot? Noob Saibot should have been in this game. I would have preferred him to, like... My followers. I don't know. You didn't really need like Liu Kang. Well, not not Liu Kang, but like you didn't really need Kung Lao in this game. I guess. I don't know. Like replace one of them with with Noob Saiba. All right, he would have been better. Then again, he was kind of dead. 
kinda, as in he was dead, but then he just came back in Mortal Kombat 11 with no explanation, so maybe he was dead. I don't know. I don't know what's going on with Noob Saibot in this game. Okay. Yeah, get kicked by Fujin. Man, Striker, what are you gonna do? Get out of here. Okay. Shinnok, your Revenants and Quan Chi suck. They all suck. The Netherrealm is like the weakest realm when it comes to their fighters. I'm telling you. Uh, unless you count New Saibot, in which case uh, they're the strongest realm of all of them. Will not touch the Jinsei. Oh, I will. Yeah, all Fujin, did, did you really think that was going to work? Like, if someone's robbing my house, do you think I could just say, you will not rob my house, and they're just going to be like, dang. You're right. And then just leave? No. That, that, that's not how it works. Alright. Dang. If that amulet was just a little faster, this whole timeline could have been completely different. Alright, calm down, Shinnok. Why can't she? Why'd you gotta do him like that? Okay, we get it! Man, why'd you have to knock out Fujin, man? He wasn't even the one that attacked you. Ready? As always. Alright, Raiden. You're perfectly fine right now. This is your moment to go get the, the amulet, alright? Raiden shouldn't be knocked out or anything right now. He should be fine. Okay. Okay. He did try and get it. Fair on him. Okay, geez. Shinnok. There's like three other people in the room. Y you might want to focus on getting the amulet instead of killing this random lady who poses literally no threat to you. Okay. I'm not sure what just happened to me, but I am sure of this. You don't even think of hurting her. Yeah, you don't even think about it. <laughs> oh, okay, that didn't work. Okay, that didn't work either. Okay, calm down. Shinnok, get away. Get away. I swear. Ooh, that one landed right on top of his head. Is this gonna work? Okay, nope, he has armor. He has armor. Get away. Nice try. Well then. Face could do that. Yeah. Ugh. Nice try. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Go back. Get back. Get back. Get back. Nice try. That was easy. You suck, Shinnok. You really are a fallen elder god. Ah. Uh... Johnny Cage, the amulet! Wow, he spent all that time fighting. Well, not really fighting. I was more, really, more so just like no! hitting you with energy balls. But, you know, you could have just grabbed your amulet and then just ended the fight right then and there. But you, instead, like, you attacked me when you literally could have just taken two seconds to walk over to the amulet and grab it off the ground. And now look at you, getting your soul sucked into an amulet for 25 years. Enjoy the new digs, Gramps. Yeah. Sonia? Johnny. Did we? Yeah. Wow. We got Just a few months ago, like maybe even less time than that, Remain we were beating each other up because properties will heal Sonia I was harassing you. That's crazy. And the others, they're gone. A surge of power within the chamber overwhelmed my senses. Dang, Quan Chi just dipped. Didn't even try to help his master Shinnok. This was like, nope, I'm out of here. But you know, that's classic Quan Chi. Let us take the amulet to the Elder Gods. They cannot destroy it. No one can. They might offer counsel, 
Shinnok can never escape. Well, that's definitely not what happened. The war is not over. Quan Chi has escaped. Why are you smiling? My dude, you're blind. How can you tell he's smiling? She called me Johnny. That's your name. Hmm. Raiden told me later that I'm descended from some Mediterranean war cult. Bred as warriors for the gods. Whatever that means. I was able to resummon that green halo. Raiden thinks it was triggered when I saw a loved one about to die. How about you, Cassie? Can you summon anything like that? Or did it skip a generation? Take it easy, Jin. We didn't need a halo in Darfur. Or Iran. Or Kurdistan. Did we, Jackie? Nope, we didn't. Shaolin monks ever send you there, Jin? I've seen plenty of action. Takeda and I both. Stuff that blow your special forces mind. At ease. You're all here and these, ladies and, and gentlemen, are our main characters for the rest of the story. Now, Amazing. As I'm sure Spectacular. You're aware, judging from the lack of gift cards, today is our team's six week anniversary. Secretary six Blake week? Says he's pleased with our progress. You could spit in his hair and he'd be pleased with Oh my god, Kung Jin, just shut up. Smart enough to have Mr. Cage put this team together. I'm glad the Shira Ryu chose me to join. New places, new faces. That's what it looks like a Shira Ryu outfit. Looks like. As the secretary pointed out, us older like something the cyber link way would make. Someday. So it's time for your generation to step up. Shaolin, Shirai Ryu, SF. Together. So these guys are going to be the ones that step up and replace the, the older characters, right? Right, so um, who, who are the characters in Mortal Kombat 1 again? And who are the characters not in Mortal Kombat 1? Oh, oh, that's... That's tragic. Uh, Johnny Cage, Sonya... Well, it's on his cameo, but still, Johnny Cage, Liu Kang, Raiden, all these guys, they're in Mortal Kombat 1. Uh, guess who's literally uh, just flat out deconfirmed from Mortal Kombat 1? That's right, the combat kids, besides Takeda, but he's like, he's like a DLC, so who really cares? Plus, like, it might not even be the Takeda that we know from this game. It might be, like, Hanzo or an older version of Takeda. And if he's an older version of T Takeda, then, like, eh, he's an old geezer. Like, eh, he's not worth anything, right? Old people, <laughs> am I right? Wow. I forgot how different Devorah's voice was in this game compared to Mortal Kombat 11. The long outworld civil war. I kind of like it better here, honestly. Might be nice to kick back a bit, eh? You know Melina's location. And a whole rebel army. It's got to be worth at least 50. 50 what? Cents? Dollars? Immediately. Hundred dollars? Million dollars? As you say. Maybe they're not even dollars. Maybe euros? Right. Pounds? Do we have a deal? What other currencies are there? Bananas? What is it, Devora? The Emperor should not be concerned. Accident ahead. This one will clear it. Yeah, Devora's voice is a lot better in this game than it was in Mortal Kombat 11. I didn't realize they changed it so much. Make way for Kotal Khan. Move! It's the same voice actress too, right? It's Kelly Who. The Tarkatans are in position. We await your order. Uh, Dearest Tanya? Me. Dearest Tanya. You look a bit, uh, Stopping a, carriage a bit white. Killing an emperor. That's kind of interesting. Power. power you have, Melina, and won't use. It pains me to use it, Rain. I need more time. The usurper's excursion came too soon. The rain falls when it may. Okie no dokie. If Kano does what I paid him to do. Just saying, you guys, Melina was at her hottest in this game. Like, this is peak hot Melina, all right? Not Mortal Kombat 9 with the Flesh Pits outfit and the stripper or whatever. Not Mortal Kombat 11 or Mortal Kombat 1. This is peak hot Melina, all right? I'm saying it right now. Even though the graphics in this game aren't that good. I'm just saying. God, Ermac's design sucks in this game. At least it's not as bad as Mortal Kombat 1, though. 
At least he's not like pale white with no mask. I mean, he doesn't really have a mask in this game. They're just like wraps. But yeah, at least there's something covering his face. Ow. So many of these are cottons. This is kind of awkward. Oh, quick times. Nice try, Kano. Get punched in the face. Okay. Jeez, that was fast. Oh. No, 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 no. Oh, I got it. Oh, jeez. Why are they so fast? Oh my god. Okay. There's like four times. Oh. I probably would have hurt though. Like, I literally just headbutted a dude with a metal eye. And there goes your other eye! Ha 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 You can't see now. Can Kano say out of his red eye? I don't even know. Oh, jeez. Look, punch in the gut twice. And. Uh, punch! Punch! Uh. You wound me, Kano. Your offer of aid was but wind and air. Keep your 50 million. Ah, it was 50 million. Still, I don't know what currency that is. 50 million what? Whoa. Where's all the, like, people who are fighting and stuff? Alright, uh, what are Kotalkan's moves? Oh, that's his grab. Oh, that did something. Ow, okay. Come on, Kano. Why you gotta be like this? Nice. I have no idea what that did. Ow. God, I hate Kano's cannonball. Okay, stop it! I swear. Oh my god, just calm down for a minute, Kano! Get kicked in the frickin' gut. Alright, what are your moves? Alright, that's boring. Okay. Alright, I'll work with it. Get to the god ray. Ah, you're standing right into it. Okay. Oh my god. Calm down. Oh my god, stop! Stop! Oh my god, I want to be over with with this fight already. That doesn't even make sense. How, how is that making a metal sound? You were using your plain head. Plain, normal skull. You have a metal plate in your head, Kano? You got one on the outside, one on the inside. You got... Dropped on your head as a baby when you were younger. Okay. Man, this dude is just so much faster than me. Like, here's me, like, standing straight up. Slow. Ow. Okay. You grabbed. Ah. I'm gonna throw this thing at you. Okay, that didn't do anything. Oh my god, stop it! I hit that move. I hit it. I hit it. I hit it. I hit it. You kick. Oh my god, I'm blocking. Okay, we're not gonna lose. We're not gonna lose. Okay. This is how we're gonna win. Nice. All right. Kano is done with. We'll never have to fight him again. You're not worth the dirt on my shoe. Yeah. Actually, it'd probably be more like sand, because there's like sand all over the ground. Alright, kill him! Kill him, Kotal! Kill him! Kill him! Okay. You just stood there, not killing him. Great. Hi, White Tanya. You are the Edenian, Tanya. I'm pleased you remember me, Koata. I will never forget those who freed Melina. Ugh, get hit with a fireball. She vowed to create a free Edenia, something you refused to do. 
A united outworld stands strong. You're just not gonna like mention why you, you don't want to free Denia, Kotal. Honestly, I'm kind of on Tanya's side here. Ugh. Oh, oh, that was a weird move. Oh, I grabbed her. I get smashed. I would smash Tanya. Not this Tanya though. This Tanya sucks. This white Tanya. Get it! Oh, I tried to use the old lady, but it didn't work. Uh, get it! Old lady! Ah, ah, ah. I got an achievement for that. Okay, calm down, Tanya. This isn't even the DLC Tanya. You're the NPC Tanya. You don't even got a variation. Okay. Ugh. Get, ugh. Get kicked in the gut. Oh, that was a weird fall. It was like majestic, but not majestic at the same time. Just gonna keep running into those, Tanya. Nice, okay. Okay. Alright. Okay. Kaboom! Ugh. Bam, bam, bam. Oh. Ow. Man, I do not like how Kotal Khan plays. And that's- oh, I thought that would kill her. And that's enough of you. White Tanya. To trust Melina. Yeah. Actually, Melina is more of a fool to trust you. She tasks me for the last time. Hi. Melina. Kano was to kill you, miserable snake. Get sliced. Get sliced again. Get sliced. Get sliced again. Oh. I don't even know what happened there. Uh. Nice. Rain is just gonna stand there. I uh, can just try and like sucker punch me or something, Rain. Dang. Another Adenian. The supposed half god. Who got here? I am a son of Argus. I was not merely declared a god by befuddled commoners. Bulak. Bulak who? What does that mean? I exploded the bubble. Surely Melina suspects your true intentions, son of Argus. Dropkick! I remember when we got that clip from the trailer of Rain dropkicking Kotal and everyone thought Rain would be playable. Ha ha ha. Stupid idiots. Thinking a character that you fight in the story mode would be playable. <laughs> this is the best voice Rain has ever had, by the way. I hate his voice in Mortal Kombat 11. I like the bubbly effect that it has in this game. Whoa. Nice. Bang, bang. Oh man. I just want to do a combo, man. Ow. Hey, how did this old lady come back to life? Oh, that was weird. I forgot you had that move. Qua er, Raiden? Rain? Rain? I meant to say I almost said Quan Chi. Then I said Raiden. Then I finally got it correct with Rain. Uh, uh, doesn't- Don't I have like a- A projectile? I don't know which, one, which move it is. Wait. Do, 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 do. Okay. Isn't- Doesn't it tell me? Move type mid. Unblockable. Oh, okay. Man. Our God Ray. Anti air throw, mace parry, soul, soul burn, soul charge. I have no idea what any of this means. But uh, I guess we're just not going to use that projectile that I know I have. Oh. Ow. Ah, you failed at your combo. Rain. It kicked in the. Or, oh, there you go. I did it. Oh, that was weird. Which. Which move is it? Oh. Okay. Let's try. Okay. Which one was it? How do I... Okay. Jeez. Jeez. Alright. Stop electrifying. Or hitting me with lightning. Oh, that was... Okay. 
Can I please actually attack? For some reason, I was just sitting there blocking for a little bit. I was trying to attack. Okay. All right, we're not getting defeated by you. All right, Rain. I'm not that trash. That I would get defeated by a character that has like 50% of the moveset as any other character. That should silence you. Yeah. All right, let's kill him. Or I guess we can get Aaron Black too. All right, kill him, Aaron Black. All you gotta do is just shoot him once in the head, execution you style. Touch him again. Yeah, he's he's yours, Aaron Black. Right? Only you can touch him. All right, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. But okay. I will. Oh, I like that. As the heir to my I am very father, down bad Shao right now. Khan. I, Melina, Khanum of Outworld, order your execution. Oh, ow. Don't hit my legs, please. You're so short, Melina. Or am I just tall? Oh, okay. Calm down. Ow. <laughs> Kaboom! Ow. 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 Melina, calm down. Crazy lady. Ugh. Nice. <laughs> I'm gonna cut myself now. Ugh. Ow. Stop it. Oh, what did that do? Oh, my, my hands were like glowing for a second. That was a nice combo. Whoa, what the heck? Normally that uppercut like sends them like flipping back around me, but for some reason it just flipped like right in front of me. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. Usually it makes it so that like they go behind me, but it just didn't that time. Well, that's cool. Chopper done. I'm getting through this kind of quick. Oh, it feels quick. Tone for your descent, Melina. Your blood will make right up the stair path to the fire's edge. Hey, what do you got that for? Oh, it's just straight up erasing people. That's crazy. Hi, Rain. All right, you left. What did my emperor see? A mere cub, grown to be a jaguar. I don't know what that means. Okie dokie. The Lingue Temple. Point, we split up. Jackie and I will come in from the south. You two from the west. Rendezvous here. The north entrance. Then what? A simple pick up and go? We bag him if he resists. Resistance might be more possible than you think. I hate to hear his voice in this game. That, I really hate it. It's like, it's kind of airy. And it's like, it sounds like whiny. It sounds whiny, but like the things he says isn't whiny. I don't know how to describe it. He just sounds like a little kid. I just don't like his voice. This might be more possible than you think. The forward defenses stand down as you command, Grandmaster. It is confirmed. Four intruders. You guys have like the same face. Are you guys like twins or something? It is time to entertain our guests. God, these character designs are so boring. Look at them. Look at them. And people say the 3D era characters had boring looking designs. Come on. Come on. Three of these people are literally just wearing all gray. You know, I, I, I think Kung Jin is like the worst out of all of them, but at least he has like an okay design. It's still generic looking, don't get me wrong, but like, at least it's not just gray armor. Damn it, Jin. You, I need to. You're an idiot. You are not welcome here. State your intentions. Grandmaster, we need you to come with us. My name is Sergeant. <laughs> You 
you demand my cooperation. Yet, you are cut off. Surrounded. What will you do? I don't know. It's kind of weird, though, that you're, like, describing exactly what's about to happen to us. Always his first choice. Okay. Let's try pummeling. Whoa. Pummeling? Wait. What are we pummeling? Ow. Cassandra Cage. All right, now we're gonna play as my old main, Sub Zero. What would your mother do? Stop wasting time and take you down. Oh. Wait. Wait. What's his ice ball? I thought his ice ball in this game was. Oh, that's weird. Man, why do they keep kind of changing inputs and stuff? Come on, it's. All right, wait. Isn't it down forward low punch? That's how it normally is. But in this one, it's down forward high punch. Or triangle on a controller. Nice. Well, that was pretty easy. Okay. Don't hit me in the face, please. Oh, armor. Okay. All right. I have not I have not played this guy in a long time but i still got the combos oh man i thought i could combo after that that would have been so cool all right that was kind of awkward i didn't mean to cancel that oh grabbed shiver miss cage shiver me timbers that was easy you are more like your mother than you think <laughs> Whoa. Katie, you could have used your like psychic senses there. Your power should have revealed my intention, Takahashi Takeda. No doubt Kenshi taught you how to use them. My father taught me a lot, Grandmaster. Let us see. Did he teach you that? To get hit in the face? Less than like five seconds into the fight? Whoa, stop that. Ow. Yeah. Yeah. You never cut it. Ow. Okay, stop that. Okay. Stop. Stop. Keda, calm down. Keda. 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 Get frozen. Get frozen. Okay. That uppercut. That's all I need. Nice. How do I do the slide? Isn't it like that? Yeah. I don't really see what the point of that was, Takeda. Ugh. I tried to get out of the way of it, but it just didn't work. Nice. Alright. And get grabbed. Oh. Get grabbed. We both kicked each other, but uh, I got up, you stayed down. Punk. You are not your father. Not yet. And you never will be, because you're not in the next two, ga next two games. You announced well, your not arrival in the base roster breaks. of Specialist the breaks. Mortal Kombat yes. 1. Military decorum is important in your family. Come on, Sub-Zero. You're not going to get beat up by Jackie. You know my father, you know me. Thought you and he were friends. Not really. He knew me when I was like a cyborg. And uh, the one time we talked when I wasn't a cyborg, uh, he got his arms ripped off. So, uh, yeah, I don't think he would remember me that well. Ugh. Ow. Okay. Get up or cut it. Okay. Can you stop with your overly long combos? Ugh. Nice. Ow. Stop it. Ah. Ow. Oh. 
Ow. Nice, okay. Back, back, back. Ugh. Get off me. Nice. You're frozen. You're frozen. Aha! Alright, now we got one more left, and it's the, the worst one out of all of them. So, I guess it would be last but the least. Come on, Sub Zero. You did not just get beat up by Jackie Briggs. Don't do it. Don't do it. You're so dishonorable. Couldn't Jing. Try and beat up a man while he's down. You suck. Perfect. Bravo. Kung Jin, you should rally your companions rather than mock your superiors. I'll remember that in case I ever meet one. And you just got smacked in the face within the first one second of the fight. Now, now, now tell me, uh, who's who's the superior one? Can you tell me that? Kung Jin? Kung Jin? Can you tell me who, who's the superior fighter here? Who, who is the superior fighter? Alright, you're trying to get me in the corner? Doesn't matter. Bam. Take that. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure you guys can already tell Sub-Zero is clearly my best character. I'm very confident with him. I mean, I'm still not, like, great, because... It's been a very long time since I played this game, or as Sub Zero. But I'm better with him than I am with anyone else. Nice. Is busy. You got beat, Kung Jin. False bravado does not suit you. I guess. Hi, right, you guys are all punks. What's up? Any ideas? Sub-Zero, let's talk. That opportunity has passed. Got a new plan, Cage? You could have followed the old Alright, let's one, execute you. them right now, You're and then we don't have to uh, continue through with this horrible, horrible story. How about that? How about that? Yes, I suppose so. Aw, oh, man. Sure, Tang Jin. That worked? This was all a... A, a training exercise. Damn. Training exercise. You and your but I, like, much sliced you guys up with a huge ice sword. Until you so, uh, yeah, you might want to, like, short. take a couple months off before you fight again.